Here we are. Uh, we definitely, can you say that we've got carried away? Well, we may have got a little carried away. Uh, and what I mean by that, for those of you that are new to this channel, that just may have happened to stumble upon this, we shaved my head. And I think I had around maybe three to four inches of hair on top of my head. We gradually took steps down to a two. We started with an eight attachment and worked ourselves all the way down to a two on the top and one around the side. But that was last week. So right now we're at about a three guard. And essentially what a three guard is, is three eighths of an inch or 10 millimeters. And I'll give you a, I'll give you a little 360 to see what the overall presentation looks like. So uh, not too bad, and at first I was a little uh, apprehensive to doing this, but it's actually grown on me, pun definitely intended. So due to popular demand, we're gonna go even shorter. Like I was saying, we're at about three eighths of an inch. I'm gonna go ahead and grab a one attachment, and I'm going to do a one attachment long, do a swipe through, see what that looks all around, and then we'll go to a one short, and then, I'm, I mean, don't hold me to this, but I'm thinking about doing a zero clip today. But um, again, that's just, a, that's just a thought for now. We'll see where we go and where we're at by the end of this video. So I guess this kind of gives you a little preface as to what we're doing and why we're doing this. Well, I guess why it's just, it's summertime. A lot of you have mentioned it, and at the same time, there have been some of you that are completely against the whole idea. I do apologize. And and again, the hair will grow back. But for now, we're just gonna do some experimenting. And one more thing, if you can tell, there's something set up on the door behind me. This is different. Uh, I actually received this. It's the um, the self-cut system. And when I open it up, you're gonna see it's, it's three mirrors and it's lined with LEDs. Boom. Oh. Now, I've never used this. I literally just set this up on the door. It was actually, it was actually quite easy. Uh, so we're gonna be in the same boat in regard to being the first time. I'm, actually, some of you might have already seen this system. And I mean, there may be some of you that actually have it. If you do have it, please give us some feedback and let us know your thoughts pertaining to this product. Otherwise, we're all gonna find out together right now. Alrighty, so we have the clippers and the one guard is already on here. And to clarify, the one guard is one eighth of an inch or three millimeters. And what we're gonna do is we're just going to take this all the way around my head. There's gonna be no fade put into it for now, just so we get a general idea of what the one guard is gonna look like. Let's head over here. Alrighty, here we are. So this is going to be the new setup for now. And again, this is a self-cut system. There are different models that you can choose from. They uh, sent me the model that has the LED lights. And let's see here. So here we are. And this also, it does come with the brackets to hang over your door, which makes it really easy for the initial setup. And uh, here you are. This should make it a whole lot easier than what uh, we're used to as opposed to just using this mirror right here. Here is the full 360. Here we go. I definitely say there's a, there's quite a difference. All right, so this is a quick run through with a one guard on at its longest length. This in all honesty is the shortest that I've ever had my hair 
in my whole entire life. So this is, I'll do a 360 right now. This is a one guard at its longest length. Okay, uh, again, like I was saying in the other videos, go ahead and let me know your thoughts. So it was at about a three guard, um, which is three eighths of an inch or three millimeters. Now we're at a one guard, oh wait, three eighths of an inch is 10 millimeters. Now we're at a one guard, which is one eighth of an inch, and that's three millimeters. So did I go too far? Um, does it look okay? Or should I just keep going? Really quick, I'm gonna drop this from a one long. I'm gonna go ahead and make the pull the lever down to where it's a one short, so you can see what a one short looks like. Here we go. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and stop right there. There wasn't, I mean, there's a tad bit of a difference, but I mean, it's not, it's really not that significant. So this is a one at its shortest length on the clippers. And I didn't do a full 360, I just did the front of my head. So hopefully you can tell what this looks like. Let's do this. We're taking the guard off. And what we're gonna do is, We'll do a no guard at its longest length. We're gonna do this on top, and then we're going to try to bring the clippers down all the way and introduce the fade, and then kind of taper it into the top. Holy jeez. <laughs> this is... That's kind of crazy. Now the thing that I'm, I think I'm gonna come across is it's gonna be very tedious trying to get it all one length because there isn't really a lot to work with so you can see those minor imperfections. So that, might, that may be a little tedious, we'll see. Huh. Uh, one of the neat things about doing this is as I expose my, my scalp, I come across scars and it's kind of, it's me reliving my childhood through the memories of seeing these scars. This one right here, I was a white water raft guide back in the day and we were having fun on a trip and I jumped out of the raft head first and I hit a rock underwater and I got this little gash right here. So uh, definitely a learning experience and, and it was, it reminds me of a good time. Touching on this self-cut system right here, it really does make it easier when it comes to the back of my hair. I didn't realize how much effort I would put just to make sure that I was cutting everything when on here I just look to the left and I know exactly where I'm at. So um, yeah, it's the it's the little thing. So I, I'm, I'm really digging this, especially for the first time using this. It's really easy to acclimate to. <laughs> All right, so and this is the final outcome from using a set of clippers at its longest lever length with no attachment. So I, I hope this helps those of you out that were wondering. I went ahead, I took that plunge for you so that you'll know, you'll have an idea of what it can potentially look like. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take the lever down all the way so it's a no clip at its shortest or no attachment at its shortest length. And I'm just gonna go ahead and kind of follow um, a slight curve pattern around my ear to the back. And then I'm gonna clean up underneath that once I have the initial line established. <laughs> Hopefully this works. All right, so we are done with the beginning of the fade. Now let's finish it off by, again, we're going to, this right here is the lever at the longest length. This around the bottom is the lever at the shortest length. So we're gonna go ahead and set the lever right in the middle, right, I mean, approximate, approximately in the middle of the two. And I'm going to just flick at the line 
to bring down the contrast just a tad so it's a nice subtle fade um, into the top. Hopefully it works out. I'm gonna go ahead and I'm going to go over to the other point of view that I usually have and do a 360 so you can see the final outcome and it, it'll be more relative to see it compared to what we started with with that first 360. Now, I'm not gonna lie, this is definitely a change to say the least, especially taking into consideration when we started this series of videos, when we started with full head of hair and we used the eight attachment and now we've worked, our, worked ourselves all the way down to no attachment on the clippers at the shortest length for the bottom part. So uh, yeah, and now I do hope that this helps those of you out that were curious and wondering what each one of the guards looks like so that, I mean, they say chivalry's dead and <laughs> I went ahead, I did this for you so that you would know and now you can see, you know what, maybe I probably shouldn't do this or or maybe you're you're even more tempted to do so. And if you do, go ahead, I don't know if this is too much to ask, um, take a before picture and take an after picture and go ahead and send me a DM on Instagram. Uh, my Instagram name is at Dansbeard, that's at D-A-N-Z Beard, B-E-A-R-D. And uh, let me uh, see what that looks like. I've already had two people uh, send me photos and you know what, I'll, I'll probably put those on a, another video. Now, speaking about other videos, I have received questions pertaining to bodybuilding and fitness. So with that said, um, please go ahead and leave me any questions that you may have pertaining to fitness, nutrition, bodybuilding in the comment section below. And I'll, you know what, I'll use those for a Q&A. Now also, before I forget, I want to thank the people at Self Cut System. I wanna thank them for sending me that product because it, it really did help out. And I know this is just my first time using it, but I mean, from what I can gather, it's a, it's a decent product. I think the quality is very nice. We'll see as I continue using this how the LED lights hold up and how that rack holds up. But from what I, from my initial take, I think it, I think it's a great product. As always, I hope that you found this video helpful, perhaps intriguing. Uh, if you did, please go ahead and leave a thumbs up and maybe even subscribe. Until next time, peace.